Record. Warning. Pause. What you are about to see is virtual reality, but not everything is virtual. The love we have for one another is 100% real. Because I'm in the uh, RV asleep. <sighs> and I always said that if you wake up first, you drive first. So I'm awake. And I figured I'd go ahead and drive the rest of the way to Kansas. Or as much as I can of it. So here we go. Motorhome's gassed up. So here we go. Alright. Get all my lights on. Now that won't affect the back, back areas there. Because uh, that's a total different area. And uh, luckily Josh was up. So he went to the poop station and emptied all the waste. Because I don't touch that. That's one thing I don't do. Will if I have to, but I don't prefer it. So we're heading out, guys. We're heading out. So excited. For another adventure. Kylie will be happy because where we're heading to has a theme park on the property. So staying at another friend's house. We, we, we're we boondocking a lot this summer. We usually, like last year, we said, like, Motorhome parks or national parks this year were boondocking. <laughs> uh, sometimes we use, you know, camper parks and stuff like that. Campgrounds or whatever, but. Do a lot of boondocking, which is fun with me. It's free. <laughs> so, no matter me, because it's free. Um, I try to make sure things are done, so. Because I'm up first, I make like a coffee maker behind me there. And off we go. <sighs> woke up, woke up because Liam was screaming and crying. He's not feeling very good today. He's cranky and he's fussy. So I got him right over here on the right side of me. Because <clears throat> he won't lay down anymore. He won't still be right where I am. He's sleepy, but won't go to sleep, so. He'll ride right here beside me. Probably go to sleep that way, which is fine. Get my little driver's assistant, huh, Liam? Yeah. So where we're going to uh, El Dorado is a friend's house. Um, staying a lot of friend's houses this summer, uh, which I have a lot of friends in different areas, so that makes it nice, because not to pay for a parking and hookups and all that, although we do make sure they get some money for all that, which they don't shoot. They always tell me, don't give me no money, we're, we're good, you know, don't worry about it, but we always do anyway. <sighs> oh, God, you guys, I'm trying to get myself oriented this morning. I try to lay back down and go back to sleep, but when we were being cranky, I couldn't, so I put, I put myself to use. And, um, Josh uh, got a thing hitched up on his end and on, on he hit our tanks and we filled the water in the other end. Because we carry a lot of like water tanks on the road in case there's a place where they don't have water. Because one year back about 10 years ago we went on the road and there was a place that did not have water. So now that we know this happens, we carry water always. <laughs> Several 
whole tanks of water we carry, so. Kids had the shower early last night, so they're good. Some places we go to have bathhouses, which are nice. Um, they're not always handicapped ones, but we adapt them. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the road's bumpy. So I have a feeling that this one's gonna be clean today, so I've got the um I have this patch that I tried made for when a child is clingy. I can put them in it and they're like skin to well almost skin to skin with me. Because there are days in our cases like that, and they can just sit in that, and they're skin to skin with me, and they need that kind of bonding with me, so that's okay. Pretty foggy morning, but not bad. Just a little bit foggy. So. Coffee's going behind me there. Almost done. So I can get me a mug of that. We got, um, something happened this morning about, um, about the time when I got up to deal with Liam. She came over, she says, I have a young man that, um, has a brother here, and we're wondering if you take him. And we said, yeah, of course, you know, we always take step groups, and that's fine. So we did. <clears throat> Liam, it's okay, honey. It's just a bus rocking. You're okay. It's just the, the RV rocking. You're okay, honey. It's just a copy pop behind us. But his name is Jensen. He's my son, Brandon's brother. Brandon is not doing well. Um, he had a bad night with flashbacks and just not doing very well. So he is very much time to sleep back there. So Jensen just went back there with him and just plopped down next to him. So when he wakes up, he'll see Jensen. Um, the thing I like about this bus versus our other one is the beds. If you're traveling, you can close that. Um, there, people are, you know, kids are in or whatever, but they won't fall out. When we hit that, well, I just had to hit a short break. The kids won't oh, fall out. Yeah, Shut up, phone. So it's 4.40 a.m. now. I've been traveling for a couple of hours now. Loving that. Got the iPad up here. For Liam to keep him happy. Uh, my brain is back there just very deeply asleep. He had a lot of flashbacks and seizures. And it's a good thing we do have custody of him because the place he was in before didn't really help him as much, so the thing that we do have those paper the fact that we do have those things in place um it's good we're happy to have those things like that in place because he needs constant vigilance constant being observed constant you know watching over so we have that in place which is good we have a new subscriber! Woohoo! Blind Simmer, go check her out. She's one of my bestest friends ever. She's awesome. Um, she is a gamer. She plays really good um, games on, like I said, I think she has a Switch or something like that. And she plays games on her Switch and she does go live a lot. So go check out Blind Simmer. I'm actually gonna find her in a minute and subscribe to her as well. So, yeah. Thank you guys. Um, thank you, Blind Summer, for subscribing to me. Appreciate you so much. I'll find you and subscribe to you back. Yeah. So, um, yeah, we have a new subscriber. Woohoo! <laughs> we have 90, I think we have 89 or 90 subscribers. Yeah, 90, I think. Very close to 100, y'all. Very close to it. Uh, also, while I'm thinking about it, go check out another friend of mine, Nick and Awesome Family Gaming. Go check them out. 
Make sure to give them a subscription and a big thumbs up from me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're awesome. And um, also, check out Bolt the Blind Coffee Man. Make sure you sub to him. He's awesome as well. And also, uh, let's take a couple others here. My Bubba, Brandon Hennis. Go check him out and subscribe to him. I think he has two YouTube channels, actually. So do, go check him out. He doesn't update much, but still go check him out. Sub to him. Tell him, give him love. Give him some love. Yeah, buddy. Um, so yeah. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Just driving along. We got, uh, about four and a half more hours to go. We'll be in Kansas. Woohoo! <laughs> I am happy that we're traveling this summer again because our family loves to travel. We have fun doing that. So, anytime someone wakes up and we do need to go the road early, we just tell them, whoever wakes up first, start driving. Because <laughs> we're already hitched up and ready to go. So, just go ahead and start driving. Unhook the utilities and start driving make sure you have plenty of water in the tanks don't the waste tank and start driving so josh was up because he was getting ready to go too so he dumped mine in his and i appreciated that because i really hate the smell of you guys there's nothing like the smell of a waste tank Ugh, that's nasty just nasty so if i can i don't touch it other, other people empty it for me <laughs> So, I'll let them do it. And I just watch and I um, unhitch, unhook the water and the electricity and all that and put switch over the generator. So, yeah, we're moving right along, guys. Um, I don't usually just take off, start driving like that, but. Because we are in a sort of a hurry, well, not really a hurry, but we're really wanting to get to Kansas before any of the crazy storms hit down here, down south. Um, I'm trying to get us going. So that's what I'm doing. Yes, I am. Big shout out to my friend AJ. Love you, girl. Love you, AJ. Big shout out to my buddy Katie, who's like my daughter. Well, she is my daughter. Big shout out to my daughter, Katie. Um, big shout to the Lonzy Lonzy, the Nick Meister. Big shout out to you, Nick. So, yeah, we're doing good today. We're just traveling right along, trying to think of things to tell you guys. <laughs> it's a beautiful day, though. Really cool, but beautiful. Um, I like driving in the cool parts of the morning because it gets me awake more, and I feel better when I'm more awake. So, yeah. Usually, and this is the thing that we used to do this years ago, where we'd take and, and go um, for a few weeks in the summertime. And usually I was the one to drive back to where we lived. And I would guzzle convenience store coffee and just drive all night. And I've done that a few times. Haven't lately, but it may happen again because, especially if we end up going out west you know down southwest like in california or something um i'll be driving all night or one of us will probably be end up being me because the fact that i love driving a lot so i don't mind driving at night and catching a nap whenever i can <laughs> so yeah oh that hurts how excuse me that's what happens when you juggle when you guzzle convenience store coffee, you end up burping and having reflux. Mm. Luckily this time, we do have a coffee pot with us. It's back there. So I can make coffee and guzzle, well, you know, drink it while driving. So that's a good thing about it. <sighs> so yeah, it's a lot. Liam's finally calming down a little bit. Brandon, um, I just checked on the monitor. Brandon's so heavily asleep, which is good. He's getting some good rest. 
Jensen just walked back there with him. Brandon woke up for a second and he saw Jensen. And he hugged him. And he just grabbed him and pulled him next to me. Like, here, lay down next to me. Just keep me safe. I'm scared. Keep me safe. So, oh, excuse me, Snowball. We have the ever-present fat cat who likes to bite. And to bite. And to bite. And to bite. And to bite. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah. Um... Because she's not spayed, we couldn't leave her at the animal clinic because they want her mixing with other cats. Huh. Yeah. Oh, not animal clinic, but the, the boarding place. We couldn't leave her at kitty care because of that. You have to have her spayed before you can leave them there. But the dogs love it. They really enjoy it because there's like places they can play outside all day. And they're outside all day, except for when they need feeds and, you know, waters and all that. They're outside all day playing. And they come in at night, they're ready to go to bed. So that's good for them. And, and I'm glad they're okay. I do. I did call and check on them um, yesterday and I will today. We call and check on them every day. Every day. Oh. We are planning to go up north this summer. Um, we did go to California last summer. So now we're planning to go to Jersey. Um, but that may be when we're headed toward New York, because uh, New Jersey's like right near us, so I'm not going to do that yet until we're headed toward home. And we ain't going home yet. We just started. We ain't going home yet. <laughs> Might, uh, so we're Missouri now, so we should be a few hours away now, but, uh, might head down to New Orleans go down to New Orleans or something. I don't know. That might not be good for the kids because um, it's kind of crazy down there. So I don't know about that. But um, yeah. Let's see where we end up heading on to. There have to be a place where there's something for Kylie to do because Kylie again is Stuck on his, he's back there. We're listening to a coaster video now, half asleep. <laughs> when he when he when he heard me start up the rig, he's like, "Ooh, it's time to go again." So he's happy about going. If it were up to him, we would RV full time. But I, oh, I don't know that I could do it full time. I mean, we did it one time. Well, years ago when we first started, you know, this journey, years ago, uh, we did RV full time for a while, but it got expensive and the work he was doing at the time wasn't very good. He's an IT guy now, so we couldn't afford to do it. And whereas the work I do is also something that helps us out, we could probably possibly do it, but um, I don't know that I want to <laughs> necessarily because, yeah, I just don't know. I just don't know that I want to full time. The place also has golf carts and go karts and stuff, and Abby really wants to try to r r drive a, a cart of some kind. So I'm going to see if we can change that, make that happen for her. And they also have uh, boats here too, which we have our own boats on the big one, big rig up ahead of us. So yeah, we're doing really good. And uh, the place we're going to, they own a campground, so they actually live on a campground they own, so. Might go, might go to Texas for a day or two to kind of check out our b, &B make sure it's okay. And uh, do some repair on the couple things outside that Jerry hasn't had time to re repair. Um. So yeah, I don't know. We'll think about that. I, don't, I think um, I think that Jerry's son David was heading out that way this weekend to kind of do some work on that. So he's got about eighteen guys with him. So may not have to do any work on it. So that would be good if I don't have to. <laughs> yeah. yeah.
so I'm just rambling, sorry y'all. <laughs> and I'm gonna be getting headgear for my phone, my camera. Gonna get headgear. Yes I am. And a chest strap. Yes I am. I'm excited about that because that way I can point you to where I want you to be. And it'll sound like it's supposed to sound, not just some sound. Anyway. So we are headed up to Kansas. And um Rich just woke up. He's back there making something for the kids to eat, for all of us to eat. I sort of ate before I got in here in the driver's seat, but I had Liam to tend to, and then Brandon started having the, melt, the back meltdown, so, yeah. But yeah, we're making good time. We're gonna have enough time on our belt to actually get to where we wanna go. And, uh, yeah, kids will have, be happy to have places to play, and they got, uh, water park, water spot, uh, water sports and all that, so. I think it'll be one of our favorite places, because Kylie will love it because of all the water sports and coasters and things. We started calling him Kylie Coaster, because he actually wanted to change his name to a, uh, <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but he, he wanted to change his name to a theme, to like a, the, a name of one of the road coasters he loves so much. I was like, no, not doing that. No, but he does um, definitely want to change his name from Kylie because we have a Kyle, so... Um, so, the only thing is Kylie was his granddad's name, so he wants to keep Kylie as like part of his name, but have his first name be different, like something Kylie Matthew. So, yeah, we're going to talk about that today and talk to Jewel because she's going to meet us up here at our place because her and Garrison are traveling with us too with their kids and big whole humongous god they got a big old rig holy crap their rig's bigger than our rig and our rig is humongous so we are almost there i'm excited though because um we get to see we get to see a new place and really want to go to san antonio to morgan's uh, wonderland for the kids to play we really want that because um, it's an accessible park for kids with special needs. It's a really cool park, so. Of course, we also want to go to Great Wolf because we always go to Great Wolf, so. Um, we're thinking about that a little while. Not sure if we'll have time for that this year. But if we don't, we can always come back on one of our fall break or winter break or whatever, you know, it's not a big thing. We'll fly back then, probably. But we got a few weeks yet before we have to be back in New York for camps and such. If our kids decide they want to go to camps. I was always a camper. I'm, I'm really hoping our kids do want to go to a camp because our kids are camp. Oh, yeah, I've always been a camper. And the camp that where our kids are going to go to is a camp that we now own because we bought it. And we're keeping it the way it is. Um, we're going to call it Camp Courage because it's for people with special needs of all kinds. So, um, we've been, uh, we've had people sending out applications and it's going to run all summer long, but we're not there yet because we don't have to be, but, um, uh, Jared's son Ezekiel is down there running things right now for us until we get back to run it. <laughs> Because he knows about running camps. He's run camps numerous times in his life. And when Jared and Lisa had their own campground, he ran that whole thing. So I trust Zeke's running. And uh, I check things online as well. I also got to monitor that 
goes to the camp that I can see. And I check the books and records and everything online so nothing's out of order, so yay on that. Oh my god, yes. Oh yeah. I might when we get there, um, after the kids are settled and we've had lunch and all that and we all take naps, I might take a nap too. Just gotta crawl back in the back and take a little rest. Liam is finally asleep, but if I move him, he'll get cranky again and start crying again, so I'm not going to move him. I'm just going to let him, let him sleep, so. Jensen is asleep like back there with Brandon. He's okay now. He's better. So, yeah, we're just riding right along here, guys. They also have a sailboat down there they want us to look at. We might get a small one. I don't know, though, because we have so many boats right now. I don't know where we're going to put it if we do get one, but uh, the guys want to look at it, so we'll see what ends up happening. Yeah. Here we are, guys. All right, guys. We're here. Come on, guys. Are we ready? I also want to take the kids to the Creation Museum again like we did last time. I'm not sure we get to that. Come on, let's go, go. We're here, guys. We're having lunch with our family and friends. It is great to be here finally. It took a while. The kids are going crazy. Um, a, f a dear friend of ours gave Kyle, a Kylie, Kylie, which now is going to be Matthew. We decided on Matthew Kylie for him because it's actually Kylie, Kylie Matthew at the moment. He's like, no, Matthew Kylie. So, Matthew, um, some portable rides we could keep with us for him. For in case there is not a place for him to ride uh, at theme parks, we have portable rides for him that they've made for him. So, he is, he can be happier. He's a happy boy. He's out there setting them up now to, to ride on them. So, he's happy. <laughs> um, we're crazy, but he's happy. So, it's good that he's happy. I'm glad Matt is happy. You know, it's good. So if we don't have a theme park near us, we can set up his ride to let him ride to his heart's content. That just increases his obsession. But you know what, guys? I'm past worrying about it because, you know, it makes him happy. He's happy. <laughs> so they also gave Kyle, our son Kyle, a... They made him a... It's like a portable elevator that he could, he could ride in. So he has that now. So he, I told Matthew, I said, set that up for Kyle so he can ride his elevator. He said, okay, I got you, Mom. So he's an expert at all that stuff, so he's going to go ahead and set it up for Kyle to ride, for him and James to ride that for a good while. So we are happy. <laughs> so, hey, Matthew, look at him. So, um, hey, baby. Hey, set up, Mama. I got Kyle's elevator set up for him and Jamie, and my rides are set up for us. So... Everything's set, Mom. I'm hungry. You hungry, baby? Come over here. So our whole family's here, gathered together, having a good <laughs> bite bite. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Anyway, so we're all here together. Our families are all together. So Hold we're us. happy. Now, baby's chatting live right now. Talk with them. Attachment. Anyway. I'm oh, sleepy. Yeah. Now, baby Mario is talking. Us, but it anyway. Kids are doing good. We're all here happily. Um, I think when some of the kids go down for naps, I might uh, take a nap too. Because I might not, though. I might just stay up and go ahead and crash out tonight. So it's about a little before 4.30. We're just going ahead and having dinner now. Not really lunch. We're just going ahead and having dinner now. We got here a little late because there was a lot of traffic on the freeway. And Jared's truck broke down, so we had to fix his truck. So, got here a little late, huh? Huh, Liam? So, some of the kids may crash early. I don't know. Um, cause Kyle, Kyle might not, but Matthew won't. I know he won't, cause he's he gonna be out there riding his rides as much as he can. And so I actually physically turn him off. <laughs> but they gave him a Ferris wheel and a little coaster. Um, it's made out of steel, both of them are made out of steel, and they gave him a, um, little, 
um, another little coaster. So they're happy. <laughs> um, they don't go upside down, but it's a ride, so it makes Matthew happy. So I keep wanting to call him Kylie. Dang, gum it. Well, you could change my name from Kyle. No, you're my Kyle. I don't want to change your name. It's like he's my Matthew. I don't want to change his name from Matthew to, or to Kai from Kylie, but he likes Matthew better than Kylie anyway, so. He had his food and he's out there riding rides right now. They also gave us um, a little thing um, that's like a. It goes up and over and down, and Matthew calls it the. Uh, the uh, the scoot about because it goes way up and it goes down. So he's happy. He's got it's like a flying bike sort of thing. He loves that thing. So he's happy. All the kids are pretty happy. We're all hanging around. Probably go to the pool and a dance and play for a while and then probably gonna get them ready for bed a little early. Cause mommy's tired, which means they need to get to bed early because mommy's exhausted. <laughs> so yeah. Is that good, Kyle? Yeah, you love it, don't you? So in a minute, I'll show you where we put Kyle, uh, where we put, oh, where we put Matthew's rides at. We'll show you where we, where we put that. And he's a genius at putting things together and taking them down because we did find out that his former father was a carny. So now Matthew's sort of his own little carny. <laughs> Aren't you, Bubba? Yup, I, well, you said I'd never be a carny, but I sort of am. <laughs> yeah, you are, baby. I love you. So they go on Jerry's truck when we leave out. They'll go on Jerry's truck for him. For any any place we go to that don't have a fairground or rides, we can put those up for him to just play to his heart's content. And yes, I know people are going to say, well, you're getting into his obsessions. But guys, when you have a child like him, who that's his big interest, that's what he loves, and he's crying because there's nothing there, it's hard. So now he has what he likes and all that. So we're about to go on the golf carts for a while and maybe go karts for a bit too, guys. We'll be back. So here's down here where Matt's or Matthew's got his stuff set up over here. He's got all the kids playing on him now. He's happy. Aren't you, Matt? Got that down here. He even got a little chair left, which I also put together, which he forgot he had. So I'm on it right now, kind of looking over the park, over the, his little his little makeshift park he's got here. And I got a Total World too, because Mister Mister Manson gave it to me. Oh, you got Total World, nice. Yes. So now I'm sort of a carny for the summertime in a way, because wherever I go, I can put the lights up and people can ride them if they want to. That's right, sweetheart. One thing I can say is this kid does share all his rides. He does share everything he has. He has never, I've never had any trouble getting him to share his rides. Huh, Bubba? Nope. I share. I know how to share. That's right. So I'm looking down. I'm on the Ferris wheel now looking down. And it goes up pretty high for a Ferris wheel. So yeah, we're having a good time. All our friends are here. Um... We're just having a great time I'm up here looking around, kind of shooting some footage of down there where the, all they are look like ants. <laughs> yeah. Actually, um, my brother, my brother, um, Bywin and my brother Lonnie are going to drive the carny truck because they gave us a car, you know, carny truck and we can put our rides up on it and one of them could take those driving in. Oh, okay. Well, good then. I even have a little bitty um, concession stand to you if I want to use it. But I don't know right now. Okay. Hey guys, so we had a really good day. All the kids had a really great day. I think they're basically about worn out now. Even Matt. Hey Matthew, you have a good day? <laughs> yeah, you're happy, huh? So, the best way to make Matthew happy was to have rides for him, so... He's got his rides. He's happy. So we're about to call it a night, get the kids put in bed for the night, get ourselves in bed. 
I'm being, I have a, I haven't napped at all today, so I'm really tired. Um, so yeah, it's been a great day. We got to, got our own on time. Yeah, a little late there than usual, but for us, on time. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're happy about this because we're here, we're happy, we're going to be here for about three days. And then we're going over to Branson, there's some, blah, 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 Branson, Missouri to do some filming there and do some rides there and stuff. <clears throat> and all that, so yeah, we're, we're doing well. Anyway, guys, I'm going to say good night. hope you are doing well. Have a great day. Love you guys so much. Thank you for watching, and subscribe down below. Bye.